strength in arms! Yay! So, uh, the start button before some stupid shit happens. <clears throat> hey, everybody! Welcome back! Welcome back to yet another little thing I'm doing on my channel. Uh, if you haven't gone to check out some of the Resident Evil LPs that me and uh, Killer have been doing, go check them out. I'll put a link in the video. And before we get started with this game, let's I'm going to briefly talk about it real quick. Uh, it's made by Ubisoft. <laughs> yeah, cool, huh? It's a uh, strategy game. And this game obviously came out when the 360 first came out. Because I was reading the back of this game. I've had this game for a long time. And on the back of it, it says, Experience one of the best... Oh, fuck me. Uh, it says, Experience one of the uh, first true next-gen role-playing adventures. So this game obviously came out uh, <laughs> a while ago. So, uh... It's a it's a strategy game, and I love strat strategy games. And uh, the story is very corny, so we're not really here for the story. We're mainly here for the gameplay. But if you want to be here for the story, I will be quiet during cutscenes, and I will make sure subtitles are on so you can enjoy it. And uh, yeah, so we're gonna do a new game. Uh, yeah, 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 whatever. And uh, say okay, there's my hard drive. Uh, okay, We're doing a brand new game. Game options. All right, screen brightness. I will bring you up to about five. I'll bring you about sixty. Uh, just no. Nice. Hold on, wait. Let's see how that looks. Uh, for me, it's that bright. For you, it's that bright. Uh, let's bring it down. Let's see how that looks. I know. I like it at sixty. It looks better. All right. So we'll leave that alone. Uh, well, I mean, oh, Jesus, that shit shoots. Jesus. Oh, my God. I was, like, tapping. We'll put it at 10. Uh, text display, one at a time, all at once, one at a time. Uh, camera up and down. Okay, we'll leave that normal. Okay. Uh, uh, change this. Okay. Uh, sound options. We'll leave, 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 leave. We'll leave it all alone. And, uh. Okay, so let's let's get on with this. Uh, Atsuma. Oh, that's an awesome name. Atsuma. Okay, that's what happens when you enter a fight. So, this is obviously the prologue. Uh, okay, so this is how this works. It's like a, it's like a chessboard. Okay, you move the pieces across the board, and then those pieces get a certain attack range. So we're gonna leave Atsuma here, and these are his attack ranges. So he only has one, which is blow. So he gets two little marks. So this is how this works. So you already now we, he's set. Now I select uh, Toya here, and I move him. Let's say I move him to the back. See, he gets Aqua Spike, so it gets five areas of attack. So we're gonna use him for that, and then uh, Makoto. Uh, he gets Beat Sonic, which is a just a line of only three. So whatever. Whatever enemies are in those spots, he'll hit. So, uh, let's start. And I can hit the white button to fast this forward. But yeah, see how slow it goes when you don't fast forward? But you can hit the white button to fast forward it. So, that's a pretty good thing. And, uh, who is this? And it doesn't tell you. It's, I guess I mean, it's just some prologue bullshit. Uh, bup, 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 bup. Oh man, I remember playing the hell out of this game when I when it first came out. This game, I for those of you who are not aware, I'm a I'm very addicted to uh, strategy games. I love them; they're so fun. And uh, I I I had a great time with this game. It was something new for me. It it, it 
<laughs> oh shit. Okay, yeah, we're we uh, wow, Toya didn't fucking die. And uh but yeah, I play the shit out of strategy games. Oh, hey, you shut up. tell you you really are a pain in the in up until the... well i'd always believed that toya was the greatest the strongest that he could do anything single-handed That one day, I would finally catch up with him, stand as his equal. I wished for that more than anything. Alright, so this is the introduction. Alright, does it read this for me? The Golden oh. War was the name given by future generations to a conflict that took place a thousand years ago. The Golems were artificial humanoid servants who were created during the war. These engines of destruction would faithfully carry out any command, even after the person who issued the order was dead. As a consequence, they laid waste to the entire world. No one living today has any idea what the fighting was about or why the war started in the first place. What is known is that one day, all the golems simply stopped functioning, bringing an end to the destruction. Humankind quickly rebuilt the world using a combination of technology and enchanting, the only form of magic that was not lost to them. However, some sought to rediscover all of the lost powers of the ancients. And thus, as the catastrophe that was the Golem War fades from memory, humanity draws ever closer to living it once again. Interesting. See, some games like this have an interesting story. This one has a good story. Very cheesy characters, but a good story nonetheless. Also, it's made by Ubisoft, so it has to be good. A thousand years ago, golems with almighty powers were created. These golems are known today as devil golems. Hey, Atsuma, come on, wake up. Professor Ko will see you. No, I can't eat anymore. <laughs> Who did this all the time in school? Fell asleep. However, debate still rages over whether these golems actually existed. Even here, at Enchant University, opinion remains divided. Impossible. Oh, Toya, just let that poor moron sleep. Nah, that wouldn't be fair. Not even Atsuma deserves to suffer the wrath of Professor Ko. It is said that in order to activate the almighty devil golems, special devices known as magic cores are required. Yeah, well, from where I'm sitting, it's exactly what he deserves. All right, class. <clears throat> That's enough revision for today. Time for a little enchant practice. Are you ready, Atsuma? Huh? What? Where? What's going on? Ah, oh, like a little snare drum there. You excel at the practical elements. Okay, so this is an interesting little concept here. When there's dialogue going across the screen, you see characters on the screen like this. You get the choice to hit A to move along. It doesn't just continue it for you. But you don't really like listening to my lectures, it seems. Well... No, I... Oh, and you get to choose. 
No, I love them. Yes, I get real tired. I'm gonna exaggerate. No, I love your lectures, Professor Co. I, I had my eyes wide open. Perhaps, but not your ears. Atsuma, I believe you need lectures in how to lie more effectively. Yeah, I think you might be on to something. Do you ever give lectures like that? Indeed. And that's quite an unexpected comeback. Really? I'm glad I managed to impress you. Ugh, imbecile. Okay, this is where the talking stops. Now they no longer talk. It only talks, they only speak during like key moments. So, this I have to read. Well, Etsuma, uh, you seem to be awake now. Let us proceed to practical elements. <clears throat> Etsuma? Yes? Please come down to the front of the class. Okay. Today we're going to learn a little bit about golems and their functions. You can help me display the emergency self-defense system a golem is uh, fitted with. So, what do I do? All you need to do is fight with these golems. That's all? You should have just said that... Uh, oh, sorry, it's still Suma. You should have just said that right away, Professor. This is what I'm best at. Suma, do you need me to explain how to fight? We might as well do a tutorial, guys. Yes, I do. I don't know the first thing about... Uh, I don't know the first thing about it. Well, you are always asleep, so I guess that can't be helped. Toya. Yes, Professor. What is it? Please explain the basics of combat to your friend Atsuma here, would you? Very well, Professor. Sorry about this, Toya. Thanks. Pew! I like the music that fucking plays. Alright. You seem to need some help with combat. I can tutor you, if you'd like, just so long as you pay attention. Now, use the left uh, trigger to highlight a category and press A to select it. What? What? Okay. This tutorial will focus on battle flow. This place is called the field. It is where battles take place. As you can see, the, fil uh, the field is divided into squares. This is called the grid. All movements and attacks occur within the grid. The field is also divided into two sections. Enemies are in the field on the right. And allies are in the field on the left. To win a battle, you need to command your allies and defeat your enemies. Obviously, if your allies are all annihilated by the enemy, you lose. Victory means you can acquire various items from your enemy. Experience points, which are needed to per, uh, proceed to the next level. SP, which you need in order to grow and acquire skills. And money, called TB tablets, which can be used to buy items. All these things are uh, vital if you intend to become a truly powerful enchanter. Remember... If all of your allies are wiped out, then you will be faced with game over. And if David Cage was here, he would say that game overs are a failure of the game design. However, even if this happens, you can select retry to fight the same battle again. So there is no need to be too scared of game over. But avoiding the embarrassment of game over is probably for the best. Don't you think? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because I, I really want to be embarrassed. That's how battles work, anyway. I hope you get all that. I hope you got all... Fuck. Screen... Screen info. Uh, this tutorial will explain the names and meanings of all information displayed on screen. Understanding and making use of all these information is the key to victory. Study hard. First of all, when you have selected all, uh, have selected or are moving a character, some information is displayed at the bottom of the left of the screen. This is essential information about the entire party, so keep an eye on the important details if you want to win. Okay. Uh, so what does all this information mean? I'll go through it one by one. Great! 
You see with the red fire icon? That represents the attribute of the uh, particular character. Many attacks also have an attribute. Attacking. Oh, so it's like Pokemon. It's pretty much Pokemon. But attacking with the same attribute reduces the amount of damage. Blah, blah, blah. Earth and wind are opposites as are water and fire and light and dark. Oh, light and dark. That's new. You will need to keep a close eye on enemy attributes to avoid an extreme beating. Next to the attribute, the character's name is displayed. Well, a name is a name. That's easy enough, even for its summa. Second on the left is the HP. Okay. Yep, yep, yep. And if they follow me, yep, 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 yep. And unconscious. Okay, unconscious characters is not is not revived within three turns. They will leave the battle. Okay, so if they're not revived in three turns. They're gone. Okay. However, even if this happens, they have not been lost forever. Don't worry. Uh, the god of the EP. Uh, EP, okay, skills, uh, if you do not have enough EP remaining, you will not be able to use a certain skill, okay. Maybe, okay, got it, yep, 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 uh, but, but, I'm gonna restore once, oh, okay, so it restores after once a battle ends. Okay, so there's no need to hoard them for the sake of upcoming battles. Okay, so your health and your AP regenerates after each battle. That's nice, a lot of games don't do that. Now then, the next, uh, guards, uh, I can't even fucking say that word. I'm not even gonna fucking try. I, I can't say that word for some fucking reason. I, I, I just can't. Down in the uh, combo. Uh, blah, 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 blah. It's required to perform combo. Uh, I'll teach you about, uh, combination. Just remember that one, uh, for now. Okay. Uh, blah, blah, blah. EX, okay. Once this guard fills up. Uh, you can use an EX attack for far more. Oh, so it's like a power attack, like a super attack. Uh, um, okay, but, but for now, just remember, blah, blah, blah. Well, that's information I need to know for now. Uh, next, let's teach you about the information, okay? I, I think we are done here. Uh, what? I can't move. Oh, what the fuck? It's moving for me! Oh my god, can we, can, okay, okay, we're done, we're done, we're done, we're done, we're done, we're done, we're done. Okay, now I'm fighting. Alright, let's do fire. Boom! Oh, beat the shit out of you, bitch! Okay, so TB, SP, uh, so money, 25 bucks. Sweet. It's a pretty interesting concept. How about that? Excellent, Atsuma. All right. Did you see that, Toya? Pretty impressive, huh? Certainly. Incapacitating golems with fists alone. <laughs> you bet. Single brain cell alert. Atsuma seems to be satisfied anyway. So let's call it a day here. Make sure you practice what we have studied every day. Especially you, Atsuma. Okay, I love some real action. If only he threw that single brain cell into his studies with the same enthusiasm. But then he wouldn't be Atsuma anymore, would he? I just get so drowsy looking at textbooks and reading about magic techniques. Yeah, so do I. Except the magic technique is part. It's just the way I am. Here's a better explanation. You're a dropout. <laughs> you hanging around Toya makes him look bad, for sure. Well, he does always sleep during lessons. But he can perform powerful enchants from time to time, can't he? Luck, that's all. Luck. The way he does them is never in any textbook. It's just he sometimes gets good Okay, this might sound weird, but I think gay guys are fucking awesome. <laughs> Dude, they they get women like crazy, and, and the way they normally dress sometimes, looks pretty good sometimes. Sometimes. It depends on who it is. <laughs> yeah, but if I've surpassed the textbooks already... That makes me a genius, right? <laughs> Certainly. Anyway, lessons are done for now, so let's go. Super kind of reminds me of me back in high school. After heading into the corridor from the Oh, now it's giving me a way. Like it's telling me where to go. Let's head down there. Okay, we're done, guys. All right, so this is this is the game. This is the game. It's pretty fun, ain't it? Uh, I I think I might cut out a lot of that tutorial. Uh, but, uh, yeah, 
This is the game. Uh, and you can talk to people. Hey, hey babe. Hey, what's up, girl? Hey, can I change? Oh, it's a set camera angle. Ah, Shima, looking forward to the festival, are you? I don't really know why we're having the festival, but still. A festival is a festival. Time to have fun. Lunchtime at last. Lunchtime. Every kid in fucking school was always excited for lunchtime and recess. It was always recess for elementary, lunchtime for middle school and high school. Atsuma, a moment of your time concerning your right arm. What? I think I'll have some interesting data to show you in a few days. Oh, okay, thank you. All right. Oh, hey there. Oh, it's Suma. Uh, so, Saria or Sa? What? I don't even know what that says. How are you? Or uh, how are you? I'm fine, thanks. Good, good, good to hear that. Good. What's gotten to you now, Asuma? Leave him be, Makoto. <laughs> <laughs> the voices I'm making. Jimmy is struggling with lost love right now. <laughs> Shut up! Damn it! If only I had confidence. Uh, uh wait. If I confessed, wait. It. I had confessed. Oh my god! I'm I'm having a brain fart right now. I, if I confessed to you sooner and been turned down outright, I would have. Uh, I would have closure. <clears throat> oh, poor Suma. <laughs> You, uh, you'd like to be able to redo things, would you? Go back and start again? Well, there is a way, perhaps. Oh, yes? What? Saving. Press Y at any time. <laughs> it's teaching me how to save. Oh, God. Well, I can save anywhere I like. That's a pretty fucking useful feature. That's right. Pretty kind. Uh, uh, pretty kind. Thank Saving up, and it's a great way to avoid all kinds of nasty regrets later on. I wish I could do that in real life. I can save absolutely anywhere. Or I can save absolutely. <laughs> wow, the world is a convenient place now. <laughs> if only the world was a convenient place when it came to fucking saving. <sighs> I cracked myself up. <laughs> Look, Atsuma. Atsuma? That loser. Is he coming this way? What should we do? If his right arm touches us, we'll never enchant again. What the fuck? They're like kids. Yeah, he's got cooties on his right arm. He beats his meat too much. <laughs> it's Toya. How handsome he is. <laughs> really? Is, is he coming this way? Toya, over here. Duh. Why does Toya always get all the... I had a friend like that. Fuck that guy. Pay them no mind, Atsuma. We'll wait for you here if you want to go and buy your lunch. What? You're not getting anything? I made enough for Toya, too. Oh, stop messing around and go buy something. Okay. Okay. Dude, Atsuma really reminds me of when I was in school. Right. What should I eat? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> My stomach says to get over to the counter and find out what's on the menu. I'd better listen to my stomach to the order counter. <laughs> to the order counter. Alright, what's up, girl? Oh, wow. Rookie shopkeeper. Orders to the south counter. Please. Oh, south. Uh, south counter. Oh, it's on the mini map at the top right corner, Kyle. You're an idiot. Friendly shopkeeper. Welcome. What would you like? Okay. The shipman's burger set. The giblets. Raymond. Or uh, Ramin. I don't know. The e lunch. What the fuck is the e lunch? Fuck that. We're gonna get the shipman's burger set. Meat. I need meat. The shipman's burger set. Eat it. it, it fuck. I can't. I'm, I'm stuttering. What? <laughs> okay, let's just fucking go before I fucking start fucking fucking up more words. Thanks. Okay, that's my lunch. Time to get back to Toya.
Hey, Bubba. I'm back. Hmm. So you got the sailor's burger meal. If I recall correctly, that's a burger that contains fresh, raw fish as opposed to your average beef pat. With a side order of deep-fried calamari. You poor thing, ordering such junk. Certainly nothing compared to my extra special Makoto love lunch. Wow, that does look good. Look all you want, you aren't getting any. Okay, you two. Let's eat. Sweet. Oh, I'm stuffed. Full and content now, are we? Oh yeah, I couldn't eat another mouthful. <laughs> well, maybe that's because you kept stealing mine. I'm sure you are stuffed after all that. Give me a break, it would've just gone to waste. I got up early this morning to make that lunch for Toya. The finest, most carefully selected prawns for the sushi. Scallops in a rich, mushroomy cream sauce. The special Makoto love omelet accompanied with the pinkest of pickles. Pink? Pickles? Ew! Not to mention the raspberry, pecan, chocolate chip cheesecake for dessert. Oh, that sounds pretty good. I didn't go to all that trouble for you to stuff your piggy face. Okay. If you say so, <laughs> I'll let him off. <laughs> oh shit. Oh my eyes are all watery now. Oh shit, and my nose it's getting runny. <laughs> That's weird. <laughs> oh I am. Thank you. Thank you. Your lunch is far better than anything the cafeteria has to offer. <laughs> Of course it is. My love for Toya soaks into everything I make. <laughs> uh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, very impressive in a scary way. Anyway, Toya. <laughs> <laughs> Dismiss me then, why don't you? That's rich coming from you, Atsuma. <laughs> so, Toya, do you know what day it I is got today? The giggles. <laughs> it's your birthday, right? Uh. That's right. Wait, <laughs> no, it isn't. Piggy. <laughs> So it's Makoto's birthday. <laughs> if you say so, Toya, from today on, today will be my birthday. Uh, I'll change uh. my birthday for you. Okay, I need to fucking pull myself to fucking get her now. Ugh. Okay. Ooh. Ah, oh, shit, I'll be right back, guys. I need to go feed my dogs. Be right back.